Welcome back. In this video, let's set up our React project to start learning about Jest and React testing library. Now to create a new React application, we will be using create React app. Step one, make sure you have Node.js installed. You can visit nodejs.org to install the latest stable release. Step two, make sure you have Git installed. Head over to gitsem.com to download for your operating system or install it with your method of preference. Git is important to understand an aspect of Jest, which we will learn a few videos down the line. Step three, open VS Code inside a folder of your choice. I have opened a folder called react-testing. You can then open the integrated terminal from the view menu and in the terminal, run the command node-version and git-version to make sure both node and git are installed. Step four, we are going to create our React project using create React app. The command to run depends on your package manager, which could either be npm or yarn. If you're using npm, the command to run is npx create react app followed by dot indicating current folder followed by the TypeScript template. So dash dash template space TypeScript. On the other hand, if you're using yarn as the package manager, the command is yarn create react hyphen app dot indicating the current folder again, dash dash template, TypeScript. I will be using yarn, but if you don't have yarn installed, please feel free to use npx. Once the command completes, you should have a brand new React TypeScript project created within the same folder. You can run the command, yarn start to start the application on localhost port 3000. Our app is up and running. Now here is the interesting bit. In the series, we are not that concerned with the browser and running the application. Instead, we are interested in writing automated tests, running them in a node environment and verifying if the test passed or failed. All of that is going to happen in VS Code. But let me tell you the best part of Create React App. Not only does it generate a fully functioning React TypeScript app, it also includes Jest and React testing library out of the box with useful defaults. If we inspect package.json, we see at testing library slash React which is the React testing library package, but Jest we don't see listed here. However, we do have React scripts. If we open node modules, React scripts package, package.json, we see Jest listed as a dependency. So in the node modules folder, Jest does exist even though it is not present as a direct dependency of a project created with Create React App. And this out of the box installation of the two testing packages is great because we can now focus on understanding more about tests instead of spending time installing and configuring them. And that is exactly what we are going to do in the next video. Before we move on though, let me quickly summarize what we have done in this video. We've made sure we installed Node and Git. We then installed a React TypeScript project using Create React App. We learned that Create React App creates projects with Jest and React testing library already installed and configured with some defaults. If this is clear, let's proceed to the next video where we will run our very first test.